What is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another Power World video. Today guys I'll be showing you how to get to the oil rig. Now when you first approach the oil rig you can see that there are lasers shooting at us from our flying pal. So it is quite difficult to approach this from a flying aspect. However if you do have a pal with a lot of stamina you can actually fly upwards into the sky and you'll be able to dodge most of the lasers and then you can sort of parachute down to the oil rig. Or another method that I did was I flew out there with my Phileris and then I decided to switch to my Fanglope once Phileris died. And Fanglope is pretty fast still in the water and I would just keep uh, putting it away when its stamina got low and it started taking health damage so that I would swim and then once I let its health recover a little bit while swimming towards it, I just jumped back on top of it and kept going and eventually made it to the oil rig. Now, you can also use a swimmer as well to get to the oil rig, so something like a Yorman Tide as well will get you there. Now, once on the oil rig, it's a very long, tedious raid. However, the loot that you're looking for is in a particular part of the oil rig that you will need to go to in order to get it. You can get the oil from killing the various enemies and all the other powers that are located on it of the oil rig. And you are also able to disable the turrets and the lasers that shoot out at you. Note that these will respawn again, however, when you do return to do the oil raid a second time. But you essentially want to make it to this room at the end of the oil rig, and this is where your main loot will be. In a chest that you just saw as I walked past it, that contains all of the loot that you will want to get. So this is a decent way to get a bunch of oil. Uh, the oil rigs do take quite a long time to make a significant amount of oil, so this is your next best thing. This is what we came here for. Alright, here we go. I'm hoping there's something good in here. Let's see what we find inside of the supply crate. I'm hoping there's something good. We used a lot of our meteor ammo. Give me a crap ton of oil. Crude oil, 120. Ancient civilization core, some rocket ammo, some speed lotuses. There's also a quad missile launcher schematic in there as well. I'm going to discard these bones. That oil alone honestly kind of made it worth it. Oil is just so, it takes so long to get. And we got a quad launcher missile schematic, which is really good. So that's actually the last technology. That's it. Is it that? I feel like it's that one. Is that the guided missile launcher or the quad? It says multi-guided missile launcher. Yeah, so it's that one there. So it's that last weapon in the technology tree, which is pretty good. I'm pretty excited. We'll get to that. I mean, it costs 50 plus steel to make. We're not very close to that. Although with this new oil, we might be much closer now, which is exciting. Uh, we're going to just discard this just in case we come across anything else. I'm glad we found this cache at the end because I can tell you what. I was really starting to lose hope that we were going to get anything decent from this. I was really starting to lose hope. But at least now we know for next time there's a quick way to get over here. We just look for this bottom bit of the oil rig, I think. Where did we come on? We came on over there. So I don't know if the structure of the oil rig will change or anything like that, but that this seems to be the spot where to actually uh, to land. If you can actually... Can you land here? I mean, you should be able to if you've got the... Yeah, here we go. There's a path down here anyway. Yeah, sweet. So, where's the location of this? This is just under here. So this is where you actually want to go. Because that'll take you up straight to that room. So you don't need to make your way through the entire oil rig like I did. Although, I, there might not be a guarantee that that chest is there. We'll have to continue testing it. But, uh, that's exciting. Now we can go back to base. I'm excited, honestly, for that large amount of oil that we just got more than anything else, to be honest. 